what's going on everybody it's your boy dom we are back with another video today 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 we got to talk about big cam newton man crazy news coming out the nfl today he has signed a one-year deal with the new england patriots it's absolutely ridiculous to think that the patriots are a team that somehow find a way to always be in the picture no matter what happens every season you know, and especially with Tom Brady finally going out, you know, you would have thought that maybe the AFC now is going to have a, a change in the landscape where there are some other teams that are going to dominate, play and win. Um, but this is a very good pickup, in my opinion, because I think that it uh, gives um, Belichick and McDaniels a lot of options as far as the offense goes for New England. New England always finds solid players to contribute to the team, and I think that is something that more football teams should take note of, especially, you know, in the NFL landscape where everything is so competitive. You know, um, a guy like Cam Newton, who hasn't really played much. Um, last year, he had a, a injury. I believe it was a foot injury. He only played two games, really. You know, that really set him back. And then the year before, if I look at his numbers right quick, he had, in 2018, he had about a 69.64 completion percentage and a twenty and a 245.4 yards per game um, average. That includes 22 touchdowns, 7 interceptions, and 103.7 passer rating. And, of course, his, his key attribute, which is rushing for a quarterback, he had about 417 rushing yards. You know, like, you can do a lot of stuff with that, and I think that... For Cam, it was probably time to leave the, the Panthers, you know. It, it was time to go somewhere else, somewhere that gives you a fresh start. Sometimes you need that in your career. You need a, a, a fresh beginning that allows you to refocus and rechannel your energy to put it into a place where you feel like you have a, a better of a chance to actually have a successful season. And I think especially with a lot of the time off that he's been having, I think he'll come back very strong, actually. I really do think this is a great move for him. Um, nothing is guaranteed, as we saw last year with the Browns. The Browns abs absolutely crumbled. But I think when you have a very well-balanced, well, very very well-organized organization, as the New England, New England Patriots are, you tend to see that they know how to control things and they know how to go about their business. And that's very important when you consider um, the NFL's competitiveness and nothing is really guaranteed along that aspect, you know. I think Bill Belichick is always a genius. And I'm a Giants fan. You guys know that. Um, he's always a genius trying to find whatever he can find uh, to get an edge, even if it's sometimes cheating. They just got fined, I think, I think a million, by the way, for that uh, whole video incident last year. Uh, but, you know, that's just what it is. You, you got to have an edge on the competition sometimes. And to have an edge, sometimes you have to take a risk. It doesn't always work out. Uh, a couple years ago, they tried it with Chad Johnson. It didn't work. They tried it with Josh Gordon as well. It didn't work. But hey, you know what? When you have an opportunity, I don't think that they were going to go uh, on all in on the rookie, on that quarterback. I think they signed on the on the fourth round, I believe it was. I'm trying to think of his name. Um, he's a very young guy, but I don't think that it was the time um, for that player to really have some type of impact on the Patriots because I just don't think that uh, it was where Belichick was ready to go, you know. I'm just trying to think of his name. I, I can't think of his name right now. But as far as Cam Newton goes, Cam Newton is a great player. He's always been one of my favorite players, and I think that this is going to be a great um, role for him. And believe me, I think he's going to have a comeback year. He's going to have a comeback year, and with this said, I think that he'll be well, very well positioned to make a run in the playoffs. If, if he stays healthy, I really do think he has a really good chance. But let me know what you think in the comment section. It's your boy, Don, as always. I'm always bringing you guys the videos. Always down for new video ideas as well. Check out the Johnny Talks playlist, as always. And I'll see y'all next time, man. Peace, I'm out.